All right guys, good morning. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday, it means it's a football day. But obviously we're in Indonesia, which is eight hours ahead of the UK. So we technically have to still wait like another 20 hours or something daft for the games to start. You can hear the building work going on behind me. We're gonna get away from that first thing this morning, go and grab some breakfast. I've got to change some money. And I've also got to buy some flip flops because the dogs ate them. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, so this breakfast is called the Shreg. We've got a bit of halloumi, scrambled egg, salsa, chorizo. It's pretty much just all goodness in a little skillet. Doing what I love. I honestly think this song was written for me. It's called 10,000 Hours. If you've not heard it before, it's by James T.W. It is really, really good. I've got like, you know the cut that is on my nose? I've got this, let me grab it, two secs. I've got this SPF 50 stuff on my nose because of the cut. And I've also got a t-shirt wrapped around my tattoo because you're not supposed to expose tattoos to the sun until they're fully healed. Even then, it fades the ink because it kills skin cells, so. Yeah, little tip again, not that I'm a professional in that matter at all, but it's the first time I've seen the sun for about a week, so I'm just spending a few hours this morning just finishing off The Alchemist, which I've literally just finished, I'm reading the epilogue right now, and then this afternoon, if the weather stays like this, I might take a little beach mission somewhere, because I've not been down to the beach for about a week as well, because of the weather. Just as I thought, we were going to get a day without rain. Yep, it looks as though the, the storms of the last few days are literally right behind me. <laughs> right, so as you can see on the screen, I've decided whether this is a good idea or not, I do not know, to stick the drone to watch this storm coming in. It's currently scouting left and right to see if there's any sort of like lightning action anywhere. You still kind of hear the rumbles of thunder. Well, it does seem quite a long way away. Hmm. Also trying to make sure that it doesn't actually catch up with being overhead of this garden before I take the drone down. It's 29 meters in the air right now. No, Gemma, that's a bad idea. Just hanging out. So far, this has been nothing short of a failed mission. But at the same time, it's not been struck by lightning and fallen out of the sky, so we're also kind of good on that front. There's got to be a wee strike of lightning soon. I think we just missed it. Didn't work. Oh yeah. All right, this is what we got. We've got a bit of tuna, avocado, chilies, and sesame seeds, and sriracha, and limes, and rice at the bottom somewhere. This is another one of my favorites. Always ask for extra spicy, and they have like these spicy peanuts they put in as well. So good. That's definitely going to be a scar. It is another wonderful day and I'm going to have to try and drink some more coffee so that I can stay up late tonight to watch the football because it's Saturday and I'm stoked about that. I'm not sure what games are on at 3 o'clock. What do I think is going to happen? By the time you watch this video, the game will be over. So I'll give my prediction now. I am going to say 2-2. Two, two. I, I can't... I think Liverpool could steamroll us if they wanted to. I think we could do the same because Liverpool's defence is poor, but I kind of, Liverpool's attack scares me. And I feel like if we have an off day at the back, they could rip us to shreds and it would just be so fitting, wouldn't it, for Mohamed Salah to come up and bury one or two against us. He seems to be scoring goals for fun. He's been brilliant for Liverpool. I'm going to say 2-2, which I would actually take that scoreline, but we do need to keep winning games to catch City, which at this point looks impossible. <sighs> I don't know. You, got, you guys already know the score, so there's no point in me asking for your predictions because you already know what's happened, but that's what I'm thinking at this point at four o'clock in the afternoon on Saturday, which is eight in the morning in the UK. So the way he's doing it, 
asking you to come out and do yes. Oh, that's when you do need the Managed to get myself a pair. The first time ever I've managed to get into the Yeezy checkout and actually get myself a pair in my size. So that is a good start to the day. Now, I'm going to change my prediction. I'm going to say 2-1 Chelsea now because I'm feeling positive. And we're going to go and watch the sunset because the rain has stopped as well. Everything seems to be coming together today, which is incredible. I'm going to head down to the beach now. I'm going to take a little drive. The beach is literally 100 meters away, but I'm going to drive it regardless. Why not? Okay, I'm doing this one-handed so you guys don't have to, all right? Pretty sure I just saw a dead kitten on the floor. That is sad. I'd also always say wear a helmet, but because I'm literally going 100 meters away from my house at about 15 kilometers an hour, I'm not wearing one today. It just gives me more to carry, but I'd always say wear one. 10 seconds later, we're at the beach. Classic little moors over there. How's it, guys? Fire. You like fire? You don't? Oh, yeah. I love fire. Yeah, it's, it's even, even now it's... Yeah. They wait until it's a little bit dry, so it's dry enough. Maybe they will fire that up later. Yeah, this one here. Tonight? I don't know, because they, they wait for the dryness, but I mean, it is sufficiently dry, I think. Yeah. Not that it needs to be any warmer here right now, but, you know, it's doing the trick. It's nice. Good vibes. And there you go, another sunset, just 70 meters away from home. This is why I want to live here. I need another shower. Yes, welcome to the vlog. Come on United, Wagwan, add you. <laughs> it's just a deluge of messages. By the way, if you don't follow me on Instagram, please do, link is in the description. All right, just catching up on one of Simon's videos. Also, double Tom Yum soup. Ordered dinner from exactly the same place as we went last night with Charlie and Leela, but I ordered two of the soups. It's just the best thing. I love it. Daniel Sturridge. Almost broke for Milner. The ricochet nearly <sighs> Okay, let me mute the TV. Let's mute the TV. Right, half time. Nil nil. <sighs> Don't know what to make of it. We've played very well, but we've not scored. And again, we need to win these games. If we're gonna chase Man City, draw in this game. It's a good result, but really it's not the result we need. We need to win. I think we're playing very well. I think the way it looks at the moment, we could go on to win the game, but Salah looks really dangerous. We're lucky there's no Mane or Firmino. Coutinho looks pretty good on the ball as well. Zappa Costa keeps getting into good positions. I don't really know what to make of this game. It's very tactical. 0-0 half-time. Not too much to report on. Okay, Liverpool 1-0 up. Salah with the goal. Second half deserved from Liverpool. They've actually been better than us. Bakioko, who's been poor pretty much the whole game. He was inexistent in the first half. Stupidly just doesn't put his foot on the ball for the goal. Salah, of course, like I predicted, scores for Liverpool. The first goal is vital in this game. Hate to blame one player, but Bakioko's been poor and it was his fault for the goal. What He's a really goal! What a goal! Did he mean it? I don't know if he meant it. I don't know if he meant it. I've got no idea, but it's a wonderful goal. Get in. 1-1. One, one. We're level. Doesn't matter. Steve McManaman got it right. What a finish. I don't think he meant it. I'm going to watch the replay now. I don't know. He did. Oh, God. That is unreal. He didn't mean it. He just didn't mean it. I don't care. It just, what a finish. Come on. Come on. We can do this. We can do it. Three o'clock in the morning. This isn't healthy. And off he went to Stanford. Felipe 
1 1. That is it. End of the game. I'm going to use the lighting from the screen to sign off of this vlog. I thought we were going to win the game. I did think we were going to win. I, I know I said 2 2, then I said 2 1. The way we played in the first half, I've got all my mates messaging me now talking about the game. City, probably going to win this weekend again. They're going to go further ahead in the table. But nonetheless, live reaction to Liverpool versus Chelsea 1 1. Can't be too disappointed at Anfield, but still would have liked the three points. Anyway, thank you for watching the vlog. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like. Remember, new video every day at 6 p.m. at the moment. We're going on a little roll. We're still on that roll, and I'll catch you in the video tomorrow. Website coming soon, as I've said countless times over recent videos, but in the next two days, it will be there for you guys to check out. See you later. Bye. Her body's gold like September. She burns through the night like an ember. And all those things we try forgetting, I remember. But we say we all fine, we all fine.